All right, guys, so today we're going to be getting into review exercises 17 through 20. So let's get into it. A review of voter registration records in a small town yielded the following table of number of males and females registered as a Democrat, Republican, or some other affiliation. The proportion of registered Democrats who are male is blank. So on our two-way table, we look for the number of males, which is 300, who are Democrat. Number of males who are Democrat, 300. And we're trying to find the number of males who are Democrats. So we look for the total number of Democrats. 300 over 900 yields us 0.33. And the number goes on forever, but we'll leave it at 0.33, and that's our proportion, 0.33. There's our answer. In a study of the link between high blood pressure and cardiovascular disease, a group of white males ages 35 to 64 was followed for five years. At the beginning of the study, each man had his blood pressure measured. The blood pressure was classified as either low systolic blood pressure, less than 140 mmHg, or high blood pressure, 140 mmHg or higher. The following table gives the number of men in each blood pressure category and the number of deaths from the cardiovascular disease during the five-year period. So we have low and high. Deaths for low is 10, total is 2,000, deaths for high is 50, total is 3,500. Based on the data here, which of the following statements is correct? These data are consistent with the idea that there is a link between high blood pressure and deaths from cardiovascular disease. This seems true, so I'm going to star it. B, the mortality rate proportion of deaths with men for men with high blood pressure is five times that with men with low blood pressure. So I did the work right here. 10 divided by 2,000, the proportion of men who die with low blood pressure is 0 0.005. The proportion of men who have high blood pressure is 50 divided by 3,500, which is 0 0.014. I multiplied 0 0.005 by 5 uh, to get 0 0.025 which is not equal to this, so B is effectively wrong. That eliminates all of the above as well. C. These data pro probably understate the link between high blood pressure and the death from cardiovascular disease since men will tend to understate their true blood pressure. That's just not true, so that is wrong. So A is the correct answer. 19. Well, fluoride mouthwash used after brushing reduced cavities. 20 sets of twins were used to investigate this question. One member of each set of twins used the mouthwash after brushing. The other did not. After six months, the difference in the number of cavities that, that using the mouthwash was compared with the number of cavities with those who did not use the mouthwash. This experiment uses the a matched pairs design. The reason why it's using a matched pairs is because it has twins in here. One is using the mouthwash, the other is not using the mouthwash. And then after six months, the data is collected and um, analyzed. And uh, this is the example of a matched pairs design. A study of human development showed two types of movies to groups of children. Crackers were available in a bowl, and the investigators compared the number of crackers eaten by the children watching the different kinds of movies. One kind of movie was shown at 8 a.m., right after the children had breakfast, and another at 11 a.m., right before the children had lunch. It was found that during the movie shown at 11 a.m., more crackers were eaten, by the, were eaten than during the movie showed at 8 a.m. The investigators concluded that the different types of movies had an effect on appetite. The results cannot be trusted because... Well, for this, it's obviously going to be the time of the movie shown because if you look at it, they showed the 8 a.m. movie right after the children had breakfast. So obviously, they're not going to eat very much, eat very many crackers. The other movie was right before the children had lunch. So obviously, they're going to be hungry. So the time at which the movie was shown is a confounding variable. So the results cannot be trusted. And there. Now you know about this thing that exists.